So the goal of this video is to see if I can use KDE Plasma as my only machine for a couple of weeks. Will KDE Plasma be my final endgame or will I go running back to GNOME? So here goes nothing. To get KDE Plasma, it's super simple and I knew exactly where to go. After all, I had learned about it while I was trying out Fedora Workstation. Apparently us normies like me should download Linux distros with KDE Plasma pre-installed like Fedora KDE, Kubuntu, and Catchy OS and a ton of other ones, but I'm gonna go with Fedora KDE. Installation was simple though. I've done this so many times already. I downloaded the AMD x86 underscore 64 system ISO. And to make this even better, my framework is officially supported by Fedora. So in theory, everything should go smoothly. But before installing, I even got this awesome tutorial that gave me a sneak peek of what was in store for me. And to be honest, it actually looks a lot like mint cinnamon. It has a regular start menu like Windows. It has a menu bar on the bottom with open apps, a time, and the system tray. Ugh. Already, I was regretting it a bit. It's definitely not as sleek as GNOME or as Mac-like, but we'll see if I can customize it to make it prettier later. 